in a school the number of students in class in each class from 1 to 10 in that order are in arithmetic progression nice the total number of students from class 1 to class 5 is twice the number of students from 6 to 10 and so class 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 this is going to be an AP that's going to be an AP the sum of all this the total number of students from class 1 to 5 is twice the total number of students from 6 to 10 this AP sum of all this is 5 times this number this AP sum of all this is 5 times this number from 6 to 10 the total number of students from 1 to 5 is twice the number of students from 6 to 10 so this is 2x this is x we are through literally why 2x 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 and x are third and eighth terms of the AP from here to go here will be 5 times common difference or 5d equals x or d is x by 5 minus 5d is equal to x d is minus x by 5 stepping down and so this is 2x keep subtracting x by 5 till we reach x 2x is 10x by 5 this is 9x by 5 8x by 5 7x by 5 6x by 5 this will be 4x by 5 3x by 5 11x by 5 12x by 5 these are the numbers if the total number of students from class 1 to 4 is 462 I think these 4 is 462 so 12x by 5 11x by 5 10x by 5 9x by 5 11 plus 10 is 21 12 plus 9 is 21 21x 42x by 5 is 462 there's a nice multiple of 11 42 into 11 is this so x is 55 brilliant so we've got everything then how many students are there in class 6 class 6 is 7x by 5 55 into 7 by 5 55 27. once we pick that the middle term is the average of 5 terms we are through nice and simple question Gosh.